be the back of just about any pickup truck on any construction site anywhere in the country, I guess, except for the fact that uh, Scott and I are squatting in the back of it. Our purpose over the next 60 seconds or so is to fully demonstrate the integrated lock and cable. Yes. It's kind of a big deal for anybody that has expensive gear in the back of their truck. It is. And this is both the lock and the cable, which I assume are fully integrated. They are. How's it work and why'd you develop it? Well, we developed it to make a lockdown that would use the tie points in any standard pickup truck. Right. Would you lock down one piece of equipment or several pieces of equipment? What is the, uh, cable. what's the cable made of? It's a braided steel with a PVC vinyl coating. Tough stuff. Pretty good stuff. All right, so I noticed this is magnetic and this is really just for storage purposes. Yes, you can put this anywhere when you have it wrapped up. But in terms of applying it. We'll unlock the one end out of there. Oh, you completely unlock? Yes. We'll so it. you free it from it, yes. all right. So now you have the cable. Yep. Pass this end through, small end. Through anywhere? Yep, go through here. All right. Through the handle on the miter saw. Yep. Pass it through the looped end on here. I have to say, I think this is going pretty well. It is. All right. And then... Pass it through the one hole in here. Now you've got two holes here. You know, we're going to pass it through. Oh, pass it through. Through this large hole. I got you. Like so? Yes. And then you're going to come back. And then we'll come through. Come through to tie down. And into the cable, into the lock there. Top or bottom? Or does Pick it matter? It, whichever your choice. All right. I like the bottom. And so that's it. Yep, that's it. So what about gear that you want secure, but you need to use it often? Do you have to tear through or unlock each time you need to free something up? No, well, we have an optional secondary cable that you can use. So now that you don't have to unlock everything to get your tools. That's why you have two away. holes over yes. there. I got it. All right, so say we want to lock this thing up. So it'll be the same way. It was all passed short in through. Through this? Yep. Okay. Through loop. That goes like so. And put it in the secondary hole. It's around like that. You find your secondary hole, you slip it in like that, you make sure your key is affixed. That comes out. That's simply the key that always stays with it when it's being stored, but yes. obviously when it's in use, you take that out. Right, and we have a key cover. A key cover. Ah, that goes there. So now essentially you've got a few thousand dollars worth of gear secured. And if the idea is you need this more frequently than these two, then this is separately tethered, thereby making it more efficient to use when you need it. Yes. I think I understand the uh, fully integrated lock and cable system. Did I miss anything important? No, nope. got it all. It's a lock, it's a cable, it's fully integrated. Thanks.